Say hi to the camera, buddy. <laughs> I know it's been like, ooh, maybe like two weeks since the last video, and I feel like I start every video off by saying that, and my bad. Um, I, I know, I know. It's not my fault. It is my fault, but anyways. Do better, friend. <laughs> Currently right now, we're in his Audi A5. We're just pulling it, chilling. Picked up some new wheels for him. Um, they're just OEM Plus. I feel like they look a lot better than the ones that are on there now, currently, which we'll show you. I'll, I'll show you all the stuff in a second, but I wanted to give you guys a heads up on what we're doing. We're on our way back to his house, and we're gonna go and we're gonna end up putting on, I think it's an axle back yep. on our buddy Corey's STI. It's a 08 hatchback. Two, three, fuck. That's gonna be nice. Don't hate me, but I literally was like in the process of recording that whole little intro only to realize that everything I did was in slow motion. So yeah, sorry. I was definitely trying to record a whole intro and I failed epically because I did it in slow motion for some reason. That's that's Pedro over there and also Corey. Um, if you guys remember back when I was doing the clutch and flywheel install video, I mentioned that it wouldn't have even gotten done had Pedro not come by and knocked the starter out for me. So shout out to him, big kudos, he's a homie. He's also the guy that gave me the uh, catalyst downpipe and also the catalyst uppipe as well, both of them ironically. And uh, let me show you his car real quick. It's a it's a 05 WRX uh, wagon. It's got a half a liter more displacement than my car does. So yes, he did actually do a 2.5 swap on it, I believe. Um, it makes I think around 310, 350. I don't actually. I'm not gonna give false numbers. I don't actually remember, but I know that's way faster than like a, an STI. And it is also on bags. The thing is gorgeous. He's got the NVIDIA N1 titanium cap back on it. Honestly, every time I look at his car and every time we hang out and we, we talk and stuff, it's like I get more motivated to actually keep building my car and keep doing things that I want to do rather than get discouraged. So shout out to him, like I said. This is what we're going to be working on today, though. This is Corey's car. It's a 08 STI hatchback. But like I said at the beginning of the video, we're just changing his axle back. He tried to start already, but I think he said something about the, uh, the bolts giving him a little bit of a problem. So they might be a little seized on there. So... Probably have to do some cutting. I'm also out of breath because I was running, so bear with me, guys. Oh, look at you. <laughs> you like fit in there damn near perfectly, buddy. I got a new uh, doohickey. It's a, uh, it's a Subi Depot axle bow. Subi Depot? Yeah. It'd be a shame if someone stole it. I can't even fucking use it. Yeah, you can. <laughs> probably make it look pretty dope if you could, though. Yeah, but it wouldn't. That's that's not even the same piping. Like my shit's literally straight, man. <laughs> nah, I can't even like. Mock yeah, there's there's no way to even mock it up. Nope. It just it just wouldn't even work on there. <laughs> Have an airline right next to it. Mm. Be fucking careful. You said air out your car right now? Because <laughs> I don't even know which line it is. What are we everywhere? There's just no way I'm going to get in there. You want to drop the mid section of the exhaust? No. Alright, Corey, you need a light. I need a light? Yeah, you need to light. Oh, I need to light. I don't need a light. Got it. Wow, look at that. that now, was... we, now we need a hammer. Oh, God. Oh, that you was... want to take a video? Update your oh, video? It's already on. It's been on this whole time. Man, that is shit quality. But fam. No, do better. We got it out. <laughs> like, that's terrible. Don't do that. Well, you're better than that, Jim. I was recording the whole time, but we were also using a flashlight. So, we literally just got it off. We had to cut the shit off because these things were completely seized on there and also, I guess, really rounded. Ready, ready, ready? Garbage? 
Not garbage. God, people are gonna hate me so much for that, but it's alright. Garbage? Not garbage. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, we need bug spray. It is all icky and gross out, and uh, these mosquitoes are fucking everywhere, so hold on. I don't think I can use that properly. Ooh! Merry, Merry Christmas. Happy, Happy Chanukah. <laughs> Get that on paint, it will take it off. Yeah, it took us all of like literally 10 minutes, but look at that, it looks so much nicer on there. Da -da -da -da. I, um, I can get hangers that hang down lower. Like the ones that we have in the um, present? Yeah. Because that's a good call? No. Just wait for it, we'll start that bitch angle, up. The angle of the fucking... What? What? We can't discuss... Wah, bah, bah. Wah, bum, 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 Ah, okay. It's at the um it's at the bolt hole. At the bolt hole, huh? Yeah. Okay, so minor exhaust leak right here from I think he said the bolt hole itself, so I think we're gonna try to flip the gasket and uh, hope for the best. Are you are you scared, Corey? No. Are you sure? This thing leaks plenty. I'll be fine. Oh, this thing leaks plenty. Subaru things. We just flipped the gasket, so hopefully it doesn't actually uh, leak this time. Yeah, we lined it up in the middle too. Oh, it wasn't lined up before. No, before it was hanging out pretty significantly. So now it's like the pipe itself is very centered, and also the gasket is perfectly centered. It's a two bolt clamp, so. Bet. That's not a fuel pump. That's his uh, air. Is your oh, that's right. You guys are. Tell them how it is, bro. Shout out to those of you guys who stayed to the end of the video. Um, we got ourselves a three port boost controller. Shout out to my boy Zach. Um, we're gonna go ahead and throw this on. Also next week gonna get a uh, tile 38 mil wastegate. So we'll finally have like everything that we really need to actually get the car running more or less proper. Um, I did also realize the other day that I'm backfiring a lot more than I normally should be. So I definitely am going to get a new fuel pressure regulator. And also, I don't know if you guys noticed, but it's kind of looking like a Christmas tree over here. That cell is for PO, uh, PO457. It's just an EVAP leak. So I think it's actually my charcoal canister back there because when I wrap pump gas, it's like weird after doing it upside down. So yeah, a couple things are in the works, but thank you guys for watching. Um, like I said, comment, like, and subscribe. and. You know, hopefully, hopefully you guys um, enjoy the content. 
And shout out to, again, shout out to you guys that actually stayed to the end of the video. You're the only ones that know about this now because you watched the whole video. So, peace out, guys. Whoop!